Hello everyone. There are countless job opportunities for you if you are looking to come to Canada in hospitality sector. If you are looking for a job, if you are looking for career in hospitality in Canada, then you need to have only two things. The first that you need a reliable source who can guide you, who can show you the opportunities. And second thing that your own burning desire. So if you have those two things, I promise you that no one, absolutely no one can stop you from coming to Canada. So now we are discussing about how to come to Canada, how to grab these opportunities and what are the things required to get those opportunities. Now let's come back to our topic. As I told you, if you want to come to Canada, you need two things. First thing, you need to have a reliable source who can guide you towards your goal. So reliable source can be anyone. It can be your friends, family, relative. It can be your past colleague who worked with you and now currently in Canada. It can be your agent or any employer. Okay, so those are the reliable sources who will guide you towards your goal to come to Canada. They can help you to find a job offer. Now, if you see any of the immigration program, most of the immigration program, almost all the immigration program, they need job offer if you want to come to Canada. So job offer is very, very important. And those reliable sources will help you to get those job offer. I am putting focus on the word reliable. Now, what that reliable means, the person or any individual or any organization who help you, who has success rate, who has proven ability to help you, those are the reliable sources. There are lots of lots of people. They are taking advantage of people's desire to come to Canada and they take money and nothing happen. So those sources, we have to cut off those sources. You have to find people who has a proven track record to help people. And that's the reason I am telling you that you have to find reliable sources. If you want to come to Canada, you will definitely look what that person's ability, what that person's or organization back and past record. When you are taking so much precaution to find a reliable sources, same time, your reliable sources, Suppose that's agency or any friend or any relative who is recommending job for you, that person, that organization will also find your qualification. For example, if you find us, if you find Connect Canada Immigration as a, your reliable agency to work for you, you will find what's the proven record he has, what are the ability they have, what are the experience they have. And if you're satisfied and you if you think, okay, Connect Canada Immigration is reliable agency, then Connect Canada, my company will also try to find out how qualified you are. So it's on the both the side. I will check your eligibility. I will check your past record. I will check your experience. And if I think you are the reliable person, if you are the suitable candidate for my employer, then I will help you. And today's topic, we are discussing how things will make it easier for you to become a reliable candidate for employers. Okay, so here we will talk about what are the qualifications you need to come to Canada. Now, hospitality jobs. We have vacancies available throughout the hospitality sector. Those vacancies are chefs, cooks, pastry chefs, baker. We need a kitchen helper. We also need restaurant manager, restaurant supervisor, front office staff. We need a housekeeper, roof attendant. So definitely, almost in all sectors, all area of hospitality, we need people, we need talented individual. Now, in this job availability, there are two major classification we can do. First is skill job, and second is semi-skill or low-skill job. Now, kitchen helper, servers, those comes under the semi-skill job. Now, we are talking about the eligibility for skilled jobs, chefs, cooks, bakers, pastry chefs, restaurant manager, restaurant supervisor. In those high skill level jobs, what we need, we need your three years experience in the field. If you are a chef, you need to have three years experience as a chef. If you are a restaurant manager, you need to have three years experience as a restaurant manager. So make sure whatever experience you have, you should choose your occupation, future occupation in Canada in the same related field. You do not change your field if you get that opportunities. So you need three years experience. That's one criteria. So secondly, you also need to have your hospitality formal education. And third, you should have sufficient English proficiency. 
So those are the main criteria if you are looking for a job in hospitality sector as a skilled worker. In hospitality sector, in low skilled worker, you need to have one to two years experience. Suppose if there is opportunity for dishwasher or kitchen helper, you just need one or two years experience in that field and you just need great with education. So you don't need much. You work as a server, you get a job as a server or you get a job as a dishwasher or kitchen helper. You don't need much experience. You just need one to two years experience and grade 12 education. And again, English proficiency, you have to have four band score of ILTS, four CLB of ILTS, and that's all. So those are the main requirement if you wanted to get job in hospitality. So you need a reliable source who can take you to the job opportunity, who can open up door for you. And second thing, you have to have your eligibility criteria made. So let me tell you one more thing. If you are meeting this criteria and if you are having opportunities, please take that opportunity if you are willing to come to Canada. If you are not willing to come to Canada, doesn't matter who's helping you, what are the job opportunities you're getting, what are your qualifications, there is no use. You will not enjoy life in Canada. I have seen people who are not meeting this eligibility criteria, who don't have education or who don't have English, but they have a very great experience. They have passion for food industry. They have passion for hospitality industry. They Still, they are able to come because they have that burning desire that lead them to come to Canada. And I'm thinking that you should have that kind of willingness. I'm thinking that you should have that kind of desire to come to Canada. So basically, this is all. If you have any question, if you have any concern, please let me know and I will be there. My team will be there to help you, to support you, to guide you. I hope you like this session. Have a nice day. Bye.